एक्सरसाइज 8.1 क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन्थ इन पैरेलोग्राम ए बी सी डी टू पॉइंट्स पी एंड क्यू आर टेकन ऑन डायगोनल बी डी सच दैट डी पी इज इक्वल टू बी क्यू एज शो इन द फिगर 8.20 शो दैट फर्स्ट ट्रायंगल ए बी डी इज कॉन्ग्रेंट टू ट्रायंगल सी क्यू बी सो कंसिडरिंग triangle apd and triangle cqb we can say that angle adp is equal to angle cbq alternate interior angles for bc parallel to ad and ad is equal to cb since they are opposite sides of parallelogram abcd and dp is equal to bq which is given in the question so by sas congruence rule we can say that triangle apd is congruent to triangle cqb as proved second part AP is equal to CQ. As we have proved that triangle APD is congruent to triangle CQB. AP is equal to CQ by CP CT. so that triangle aqb is congruent to triangle cpd so in triangle aqb and triangle cpd angle abq is equal to angle cdp alternate interior angles for bc parallel to cd and ab is equal to cd since they are opposite sides of parallelogram a b c d and b q is equal to d p which is given in the question so by s a s congruence rule can say that triangle aqb is congruent to triangle cpd as proved fourth aq is 
equal to CP as we have proved in third that triangle AQB is congruent to triangle CPD therefore AQ is equal to CP by CP CT as proved fifth part AP CQ is a parallelogram as we have proved in second and fourth from second and fourth AQ is equal to CP and AP is equal to CQ and since opposite side in a quadrilateral APCQ are equal to each other we can say that APCQ is a parallelogram since opposite sides in quadrilateral APCQ are equal to each other we can say that APCQ is a parallelogram as proved